Good evening, everybody. My name is Rachel Harry, and I will be your host uh, this evening for the first of three celebrations honoring the 25th anniversary of the Trillium Book Award. Let's put it up for that. We have uh, an incredible lineup of authors this evening. We have Ian Brown, Wayson Choi, Austin Clark, Ann Michaels, Nino Ricci, Jane Urquhart, and Richard B. Wright. This is indeed, this is the room to be in. Uh, so as, as I'm sure you can all do the math, we have seven authors. So each is going to read for about 10 minutes or perhaps they, they will choose to speak or however it is they want to present themselves. Some will be here with the book that they won the Trillium Award for. Some will be here with a, another work that you will be hearing from, uh, possibly something more recent. You'll have to wait and find out. Uh, before we get started, just a quick note about uh, what it is that has brought us here together for this amazing event. For the past several years, the Ontario Media Development Corporation, the OMDC, has had the honor of managing the province of Ontario's Trillium Book Award. Now that the Trillium Book Award is turning 25, OMDC, in partnership with Open Book, Amy, uh, the amazing Amy Logan Holmes is around somewhere, I is thrilled to have the opportunity to showcase the literary talent and diversity of our Ontario authors at this evening's reading. One of the more unique things about the Trillium Book Award is that it is open to books of any genre, fiction, nonfiction, drama, children's books, and poetry. This makes for a rich and diverse range of fiction and nonfiction winning titles over the years, as well as on the short list. Originally, there was just one award given out annually for English language titles. Several years later, in 2003, the Trillium Book Award for Poetry arrived. Uh, some of those poets will be reading uh, later on in April, but we're we'll talk about other events later on. And similar awards are now given out also in the French language to Franco-Ontario authors. When we look back at the list of past winning authors of the award, we see how great this writing legacy is. We have so many internationally acclaimed writers who call Ontario home.